Hey, Kathy. It's uh, funny you should mention that you wanted to put your rain bench on your deck because that's exactly what I did. I got, uh, here's a railing. There's the diverter that goes out of the downspout. It's got to be above the top of the rain bench. But then what you see right there is that 130 gallon rain bench up on our deck. Sorry, it's up a little high, but see the cedar face going all the way along. It's two rain benches tied together. And what we've done is tap it into the side, fills from the bottom like you see. There's another bench up here, fills from the bottom. And we're doing exactly what you are proposing to do. And we've oh, it's been working all, oh, there's a little, little robin's nest too. <laughs> But it's been working for us all summer like this. I don't know if you can see that, but there's our irrigation line running all the way along the inside of our deck. And it goes probably about, sorry about the sunrise in your eyes, probably about, oh, 30 feet, 40 feet over to the other corner of our deck, comes up. We've actually drilled a hole through our deck. <laughs> Yeah, diehards. Um, <laughs> goes up through to another rain bench up top. Um, and this one actually has an opening, uh, empty area for a hose reel that's built in and a pump. Um, and then it's got the overflow. The overflow for that comes down 